The banded mongus, Mungo's Mungo, is a mongus commonly found in the central and eastern parts of Africa. It lives in savannas, open forests and grasslands and feeds primarily on beetles and millipedes. Monguses use various types of dens for shelter including termite mounds. While most mongus species live solitary lives, the banded mongus live in colonies with a complex social structure. The banded mongus is a sturdy mongus with a large head, small ears, short, muscular limbs and a long tail, almost as long as the rest of the body. Animals of wetter areas are larger and darker colored than animals of drier regions. The abdominal part of the body is higher and rounder than the breast area. The rough fur is grayish brown and black, and there are several dark brown to black horizontal bars across the back. The limbs and snout are darker, while the underparts are lighter than the rest of the body. Banded monguses have long strong claws that allow them to dig in the soil. An adult animal can reach a length of 30 to 45 centimeters and a weight of 1.5 to 2.25 kilograms. The tail is 15 to 30 centimeters long. The banded mongoose is found in a large part of East, Southeast, and South Central Africa. There are also populations in the northern savannas of West Africa. The banded mongoose lives in savannas, open forests, and grassland, especially near water but also in dry, thorny bushland but not deserts. The species uses various types of dens for shelter, most commonly termite mounds. They will also live in rock shelters, thickets, gullies, and warrens under bushes. Monguses prefer multi-entranced termite area with open thicket, averaging 4 meters from the nearest shelter, located in semi-closed woodland. In contrast to the den of the dwarf mongus, Banded mongus dens are less dependent on vegetation cover and have more entrances. Banded monguses live in larger groups than dwarf monguses, and this more entrances means more members have access to the den and ventilation. The development of agriculture in the continent has had a positive influence on the number of banded monguses. The crops of the farmland serve as an extra food source. Banded mongus feed primarily on insects, myriapids small reptiles, and birds. Millipedes and beetles made of most of their diet, but they also commonly eat ants, crickets, termites, grasshoppers, caterpillars and earwigs. Other prey items of the mongus includes frogs, lizards, small snakes, ground bird and the eggs of both birds and reptiles. On some occasions, monguses will drink water from rain pools and lake shores. Banded mongus forage in groups but each member searches for food alone. They forage in the morning for several hours and then rest in the shade. They will usually forage again in the late afternoon. Monguses use their sense of smell to locate their prey and dig them out with their long claws, both in holes in the ground and holes in trees. Mongus will also frequent near the dung of large herbivores since they attract beetles. Logrants are produced 